Hello guys! Not even kidding, it is actually several hours later after my encounter with the uh, hell. <laughs> I actually had to take a break, it freaked me out that much. But I'll be fine. It's only a game, all that crap. All the crap people usually tell me, oh it's just a game, it's not real, and it's still fucking scary. <laughs> Oh, 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 have a haircut. Boop. 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 I do apologize if I went a little bit too far with all of the uh, nope and such when I was editing because I just needed to make it funny for me. <laughs> But I'm sure it was okay. Tag it! Tag it! Yeah, these guys aren't so bad. Yeah, let's go up and see what's up here. Or have I already gone up? I don't remember. I don't think I have. Oh yeah, up here there's no way through. Yeah, I think it's all just the same. Whatever. Actually, no, this is the way that I went and found it last time. So let's <laughs> just revert that idea. Trip that off so it's out of the way. Let's see what else is this way. We'll fight spiders. Please. It wouldn't even. Bo yes, they bother me. And sh oh my god. Oh! Why can't they fly? <sighs> I don't know if it was James's idea or Michelle's idea. Who. Oh my god, he ever had that idea? I don't fucking like you. <laughs> like your game, don't like you. I mean, I do like them, they seem very likable. <laughs> ah, and you spit poison. Fuck off. Oh my god. Why have I got... Mm, these are not going to help me here. Well, I guess it's a little bit of ranged attack. You need to fuck right off. If I can get these guys fight the spider showing up. So remember how I said if they don't use spiders again, it'll be uh, it'll be too late. Didn't think they would make flying spiders. Uh, so many flying spiders. Bye. Oh god, this is honestly, it's not even cool. This is horrible for me. Oh yeah, okay. Yes, hi, hello. Please just stop existing. Do I want to go this way or this way? Let's go indoors. Oh, thank God. What the fuck is in there? There's something there. Oh, okay. Stone leader. Cool. I don't trust anything in this game anymore. <laughs> Wait. What? Oh. Huh? Oh, whatever. I'm sure there's another way. Not that way. Don't go that way, kids. <laughs> A mysterious cleric steals your money. Thanks, buddy. Glad you're always there for me, you cunt. 
<laughs> I wonder if there's anything over there. Nope, just a trap. I wanna see what it does. Oh, you're... Oh, God, you're a... Very happy turret. Okay, that's enough with the poison. I'm just gonna do this. Mulligan! Ah! Uh oh. Boop. <laughs> it's like num num num. My sword will eat you. Bye. Bye. Oh god. <laughs> nice try, buddy. Ow. See how that worked out for you? Now you're dead. Um, yeah, we can go this way. Kill some more saltless. See if I can get some more drops from them. Yay, I got seven. Bag of salt. Nice. I like getting consumable salts. <sighs> Not fun at all. Thank you. Oh no, I was really hoping they would die on one go. Yeah, they did. <laughs> Ooh, Virulent Scimitar. Oh, I can actually use that. Class 3 sword. A crude iron scimitar covered in a thick layer of rust and grime. Oh, it's got poison. Its distinctive flared tip and primitive construction betray its origins in the Stesian bogs of Gulchmire, where such weapons are carried on hunts by the native tribes of bloodthirsty lizard folk. <laughs> the oily sheen of myriad lethal poisons on its chipped blade must have accumulated over countless years of hacking through Gulchmire's toxic vegetation and flesh hungry carnivorous flora. Cool. Doesn't seem like a bad weapon. That's funny though. 126 attack to 40. <laughs> That's amusing. Ah, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Nearly got me. Nice try. What's in here? Oh, a shrine. Nice. Yeah, let's just eat. That was a good idea. <clears throat> oh god. Is this back to the cavern? Yeah, it is. Well... Yeah, sure. Let's take a look. Grey pearl. Ah, okay. Venomous bleed. Oh, okay. I'll just keep saying, oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Mire of Stinch. Those guys look like they had a bad time. Come on. I'm just so uncomfortable. Oh, red hair charm. I didn't even notice them. Ooh. A simple charm of soft red fur taken from a baby aurux. Aurux are fiercely protective of their young, and successfully collecting the fur of a baby aurux requires a particular combination of bravery and foolishness. 
Greatly amplifies its greatly amplifies attack power when the wielder is near death. No thanks. I'm happy having good attack all the time. Uh, that guy has a building on his back. <laughs> do you, see, you do see some really huge, crazy weapons in this game. Let's go this way. Uh oh. That's not fair. Ah, uh, yep. See ya. Uh, fuck it, I'll take it. Ah! <laughs> uh, spider! Let me just uh, do this. And this will take me to the shrine. <sighs> Fucking spiders, oh yeah, nothing there. Nothing there anymore. Yeah, fuck it. <sighs> oh god. It. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's like when they were designing this, they were like, what could we do to piss them off the most? Well, <laughs> good for real. <laughs> uh, I can't poison them. Maybe I can get them one at a time. Come on. If I can at least get them without him, should be okay. If I seem like I'm a little bit better at dealing with them, I'm not. I'm freaking out every two seconds. Now I can fight the boss. Oh, now I can uh, get this chest. Alchemist's apron cover. Oh, it's the Alchemist set. Cool. Hmm. Oh, now I can fight the boss. Um. Let's not. Let's go back to Sanctuary first. Ah! <clears throat> okay, if that's a ledge going up, it should be a ledge going down. Just saying. Oh, and he brought me to the shrine. <laughs> you suck. You might be thinking, why didn't you show us level up? Why didn't you show the journey? Uh, I died to the free spiders around the night because this place is very, very tricky to run away from enemies. Okay, that's painful. Bye. Yeah, especially flying enemies with uh, the ability to breathe poison and scare the shit out of me and, you know. That's life. I also lost all my salt. At least that's the point I was making. So, somehow I don't think I'm going to be able to poison this boss. Just a feeling I get. So, let's put on fire. And I guess lightning, why not? We'll go with the fire first. What the fuck is that meant to be? That stench most file. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a... Cool. Yeah, my plan of attack is just beat the shit out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I think it worked. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, the hardest boss in the game. Mm. That stench most files. Tooth. 
let's read that. <laughs> Why was I worried about that? Oh dear. Where is his tooth? There it is. Tooth of that stench most vile. <clears throat> A simple al alchemical experiment gone wrong. The creature from which this tooth originated did have the distinction of being considered a god by at least one particularly afflicted community. Okay. Cool story, bro. Uh, okay. <laughs> Stop running off. Yeah, okay. Trying to figure out which direction to go, in which order in this game is a nightmare. Oh, hey. Hey, stranger. You're like me, aren't you? You hunt monsters for their salt too, don't you? Yes. That's what I thought. My hunt led me to this mire. Through that cave is a blocked passage. I recognize that barrier, though. It's called Redshift. Finally, I can get through this crap. There is a brand that allows its owner to cut through Redshift with torchlight. It is a, a secret guarded closely by us blood bros. But these are extenuating circumstances. Would you like the brand? Yes, please. Very good. Your hand, then. In marriage? <laughs> Redshift brand. Wear this brand to imbue your torch with a light allowing you to pass through the red arcane obstructions known as Redshift. Yay! See with the eyes of a hunter. My people created Redshift barriers centuries ago to contain beasts. We were hunters of nightmares. Beastly thralls, possessed animals, demonic spirits. We sometimes captured our quarry to be held in the prisons of Redshift. <laughs> this island is full of Redshift barriers, but uh, I didn't place them. I don't know how to build Redshift. I don't think anyone does anymore. Somebody does. That secret died generations ago. This island draws people from so many places. And times? A fellow bro bro blood bry must be here there. Must have been here from centuries ago. Hunt fiercely, friend. You were part of hunts against beasts. I am going. Oh, okay. I think I know where this is taking me. Yeah, there we go. Awesome. I do need to go back this way, though. But I don't know how that would work. Try this. Ow! <clears throat> um, but there's other places to go. Damn it. Ah. I'm going to have to travel, I guess. Okay, that's not... Let's get one level. Yay! Let's get one level from killing the boss. Great. Two pearls, one gray pearl, what do we do with it? Bam. Um. It's always good to have more stamina, and it's definitely always good to have more strength. So I feel like I've actually gone about this the wrong way, because this place is uh, the mire something, whatever. 
And the place where the horse guy is the fort before the mire. This is the mire stench, and the other place is the fort before the mire. So maybe I'm gonna go there first, or it's just the name. I don't know. Snap. So I'll just pull him. Very nice. Anybody want to drop the drawing sensor thing for me? That'd be nice. More soldiers' poems. Ring required ahead. Really? For what? I didn't need a ring. Which reminds me. Put this bad boy back on. Wipe. Yeah, so there's this way to go. For an item. Mossy ring. A polished wooden ring adorned in plain moss. Its gemstone is said to link the life of the forest to the will of its wearer. Increase stamina regeneration. Yes, all about that. And my attack's pretty high. All about that. That's excellent. Oh. Was that the only thing? Shit. <laughs> Nothing new. Okay. That's pretty cool though. Some cool stuff. Do you find it interesting that you can wear the alchemist set? Bird-like head protection worn by an alchemist. The beak is filled with pleasantly smelling flowers and herbs to protect its wearer from the illness carried by vile vapors. You could almost call him a crow hunter. Because, look at this, the fur-trimmed canvas robe of a veteran alchemist. It is lined with pockets and vial sleeves for carrying various cells and ingredients. You could almost say that it's covered in feathers. We could put this on. <laughs> oh dear. Lord. <laughs> the purple knight let me just stick with what I have oh that adds so much yep not wearing that could wear this it's not too bad actually still gonna wear this I like this So yeah, there is a path over here which I haven't taken and I need... Ooh, I have one. I see you! Yeah, pricks. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Aha! Ugh. Finally! Didn't even drop anything for me, how rude. Da da da! This game is so nice! <laughs> Kidding. Where the fuck you going? Kired. It's off. Oh god. Ah. There you go. That's how you deal with that. You parry the horse to knock it on its ass. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm usually good at powering this guy. Okay. There we go. Sit your ass down. Get wrecked. 
See ya, buddy. Gray Pearl. What's in here? Whoop! Oh, okay. There's just so many ways to go in this game. I hear water. And a chest. Blood bry. Well, look at that. <laughs> oh, it must be light armor. Yeah. That's a shame. The Blood Bry were a secret society of arcanists from a time when beasts were a more serious threat to man. <laughs> the society fell into obscurity shortly after an aspiring lord tried to repurpose them into a personal brute squad, sending them to hunt supposed witches who in reality were merely political rivals. There's a lot of emphasis on a time when beasts were more serious. And lands which aren't meant to be here, people from different times. Okay. I need you to stop being here. Okay. Just, nope, I thought it was somewhere I could jump. Smack. The Rune Temple. Wow. Oh! Hey, buddy. Whoa! Fucking hell! <laughs> That's clever, getting you to focus on that guy and then ambushing you. Very clever. I didn't realize my champ was in Salt and Sanctuary. Drowned Idol. Grey Pearl. It's a bit of a shame that you can cheese enemies like that, but oh well. It's a thing you can do, so I'm doing it. What the fuck? He threw his arm at me. <laughs> okay. Cool. You fucking psycho. I know if I jump over there, it'll hit me out of the air. So. Get poisoned, bro. I have so much stamina. It's so nice. Whoop, there he goes. Hup. Impossible? No. Need brand of light. Sorry, I have something in my eye. It was my finger. Ah. Oh, I think I know where I am. Let's take you out the front of the dome. Ta-da! Okay, well... <laughs> back I go! <clears throat> it is interesting that they have such little shortcuts. I kind of thought... There must be a way to go deeper in this area because they wouldn't name it something like the Rune Temple. They wouldn't give it a different name if it wasn't its own area as well. Or maybe they would. I don't know. I didn't make the game. Is that a secret? Nope. Pricks with spears, though. I'm climbing the pyramids. The ziggurat. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Uh. Ooh. 
Oh, cool. Now if you drop something, I can pick it up. You didn't drop anything, you suck. Let's see what happens if I climb to the top. I wonder if they put in the climb just for the nice view. Because that's a nice view. I like it. I am a sucker for nice views. Is that Laura Dryan in the background? <laughs> Perhaps a strong lick. Or, uh... Uh, what's the new place called? I don't remember. Four message bottles set on top of the wall. Pyramid thing. Where you are, Soul Series. Okay. Dark Soul Free is near. That is very true. <laughs> you monster. Trust the art. Yes, it is very nice art. Look at that. Ah. Ooh, a ladder. Marshall Fleal. This should take us. What the fuck? What? What are they? Ah, get fucking crushed. Uh, yeah, that should take us below the uh, ruined temple. Damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> Bastards. <laughs> well, it's almost as if they planned it. Ah, oh, crap, really? Ah! Oh. oh, dear. Ta da! Or is this just another. Oh, it's a sanctuary! Sweet! Oh, I'm finding all the new areas. I'm gonna find out where that boat guy takes you, though. Leader, uh, didn't mean to put the cleric down. Might as well put all these guys down. Still need those ears. Nothing new. What about you? I haven't spoken to you yet. It is said that magic entered the forest with Ganwar the Filthy. He was a mage of fire and sky. His wizardry was decent, but his hygiene was lacking. <laughs> Ganwar recorded many spells and, and, and incantations in a tome called the Codex Malefiant. Malefiant. It's mostly nonsense, but he recorded a few useful things. Okay. These aren't anything new. Nor is that. Oh, well, that's... Pip. Uh, level up. Just once. Uh, ooh, I have three grave rolls now. Damn. Probably still gonna lean on strength, though. But we'll save up so we can use the higher level swords and we'll get the four points of strength anyway. You look friendly. Oh, wait. Charred doll. A chest. What's in it? Oh, okay. My starting set. That's pretty cool. Can I get one with a damn great sword? What is this way? Not one of you. And one of you. Oh! How would I? Oh, okay. Duh. How would I even get up there? Ledge. Oh, poison. Oh, okay. Uh. Oh, okay. <laughs> my. Pretty much my base commentary is. Oh, okay. 
And you're the guy that I killed not too long ago. You didn't drop anything for me. And again. You suck. I don't need to go there. Ooh. Up, up, up. Ow. Okay. Let's equip a torch. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> I didn't even come this way the right way up the first time. Up. Uh. Excuse me. Don't mind me. Oh, cool. Okay. Stone charm. Ow. I imagine that will be more balanced damage. And stagger damage. A simple charm carved from solid stone. A charm like this would promise resolve, clarity, and will to those who lack those things. I don't, but, uh... That would be nice. 117, 129. I'll take the damage penalty. Draw and lock it. Can I get a sensor, please? Damn. Okay, I guess I need to be upside down for here. Yeah, I think it'd be much better to have the stagger damage that way combos will just work a lot better which will let me inflict more damage than just stronger hits I hope <laughs> listen to me I'm a tactician I want that item don't know how to get it Ooh, looked like there was something there. And this opens this. There's a chest. Oh, wow. What were the odds? That, I swear to God, I haven't been here and I didn't know that. That was just gut feeling. I swear I did not know that. I've been thinking it with the past few chests, like there's a lot of chests around, there hasn't been a mimic in a while. Oh god, you're a you're a boss. <laughs> yep, boss fight. We will uh keep exploring because there is other ways to go. And I don't even remember if I found a sanctuary in here, I don't think I did. That's gonna hurt! Oh, Oh, my prediction was correct. That's twice now. <laughs> In the chest. And uh, this fall is going to break my knees. Oh, like that. I didn't go this way. Oh, hi. Oh, shit. Uh, ow. Uh. Haha. You wanna teleport down here? That'd be cool. Or you can die up there, it's up to you. You're gonna die either way. Ow. Ow. Oh shit. Oh my health. How much health do I have? 1.1. Damn. I almost got rectified. Wait. Oh no, he's there. Ooh. An immense shield of carved, carved granite smuggled from the forbidden Jindarin. Arch, archipelago by what? <laughs> the Jin, Jindarin, Jin, Jindarian, <laughs> Jindarin archipelago by an unscrupulous merchant. Apparently, once part of a much larger mural, its chiseled surface bears a low relief of interlocking bones. 
surrounding a chilling effigy of death. Little Grave Lord Needle sounding. Owing to several terrifying, terrifying and inexplicably rice bed rumors, few outsiders venture to that place, and little is known of its inhabitants even today. The fool who courted their ire to privilege, pillage this demonic artifact was surely more driven by greed than common sense. Ho oh. Oh, screw it, I can use it. Where? Oh, I, know, I think I know where this is. Yeah. Cool. There has to be a sanctuary in here. Did I get a sanctuary in here? I don't remember. Down here. Um, no. Oh, come on. Not one of you guys. Hmm, can't see anything. So, nowhere I can go, basically. Well, can go down there, but I don't think so. Looks like it's just this boss. Yeah, there's a sanctuary right here. I'm fucking stupid. Boss fight, it's a boss fight, it's a boss fight, it's a boss fight. Oh god, I forgot. <laughs> Oh, okay, nothing there. And there's a chest there. Let's just go to the boss fight. Ah, oh, do I have to go upside down to get up? Okay, I'm not even going that way. Why am I completely? Dumb dog. I get the feeling these might be, uh, ow, court sorcerers, so I really want to see what they drop. Asshole. No, they're leeches, that's right. Forgot about that part. Oh, I don't have to pull that down every time. Um, yeah. Poison might actually help me this time, so we can give that a shot. The Dried King. Hey, buddy. Fire! Of course it's fire. Whoa, Jesus. Uh oh. Oh, God. You suck. Whoops. Ow. Can he be poisoned? That's a horrible combo. Oh, ow. I don't think I can poison him. Nah, I get staggered. <clears throat> Aha! Stagger him? I think he did. He takes a beating though.
Ooh. Combos. You can't hit me if I keep staggering you. Although I need my uh, I need my stamina. There we go. He's an easy fight. A little bit uh, shocking when he pulls out that beam move, but apart from that, the Ziggurat. The Dried King's Ashes. We'll read that. Ashes of the Dried King, a once proud ruler who spent his twilight years in paranoid madness, hiding in his life's legacy, the Ziggurat of Dust. He is a creature of fear and self-pity, perpetually lashing out against imagined demons with searing flame. Hmm. Interesting guy. Another brand. Good God. Huh? So you killed him. You killed the king. Quite a relief. But is this a dream? The ziggurat we're in. Well, it reminds me of that great tomb built by the Sun King of Kulkas. The Sun King. Praise the sun, yo! Kulkas is where I studied until the mission. We were to sail to the west for a marriage alliance, I think. Yeah, everyone's here for the same reason. No, that's wrong. We were to sail to the east, to Lyman. We were to make peace with the Citadel, to Fire and Sky. So, I think, and this is just a guess, with all the talk of different places being here and people from different times, it's like, it perhaps is a ritual kind of thing, where people are sent to this island for something. Maybe. I don't know. Just a thought. Kulkas sitting... Kul <laughs> their sitting king has just announced an alliance with Ascaria, and with it, allegiance to their new gods. The climate for sorcerer collectives would surely sire. So we sailed, but there was a storm at sea. I was washed ashore. I don't think any of my fellow sorcerers survived. When I find the cigarette, I thought I'd gone mad. But I'm no stranger to dark magic. Imagine a demon that feeds off the ruins of nations. A demon that collects. Yeah, it's the Scarecrow guy. Such a powerful being could dwell on this island. Or perhaps this island is the demon. And it feeds. Claiming men, women, kings, countries, donkeys. <laughs> I want you to explore my theory. And I have just the thing to help you do it. I have something for you. It might burn a bit, but aren't all good things found in flame? <laughs> yeah, like, uh, like Lord Souls. <laughs> Boop. Storied. I must have all the brands. Wear this brand to gain the ability to perform a mid-air dash. Oh, that's sweet. If you find the ruined temple, you'll know my theory is true. Uh, dude, your theory is true. <laughs> what about you? Do you agree? Yes, because I find it. Of course, this island is a graveyard of civilizations. Find the ruined temple. We'll get to the bottom of this. Damn, there's so many people to keep up with. Where's Quest, bro? Where's Fi- Ah, very nice. Where's my Fifi friend? Where's Mints? Oh. oh, that's cool. What does this guy drop? Okay, that's really painful. Drops a soldier. Ugh, where am I gonna find a sensor? <sighs> the 
let's see what else is this way. I know the ruined temple's here, but I can come back. I want to see what's over here. Bullens. Shipwrecks. The far beach. Uh, the other side of the Shivering Shore, I guess? Like, this is the opposite. Yeah. My reflection scared me. <laughs> oh, hi. Lots of wrecked ships here. Pretty sure I'll be able to scrap something together here. Thanks for keeping me company, friend. I'd take you with me if I could promise a safe journey. But I can't, so I won't. Besides, you've got a leader to find, be it a princess or a slave. For your trouble, here's a share of the spoils I've found. Oh, I got it. Ooh, a frozen tomb. I got a trophy. That must be her quest, then. If you find your way off this island, come to Coast Rock. Find the Red Falcon and ask for Edward. My name's not Edward, but that's how you'll find me. <laughs> Excellent. That's witty as fuck. Um, Edward Kenway? So I must be getting closer to the end if I'm finishing quests and shit. It's Boat Guy! See a passage around the bay? Do we venture west, friend? Sure, because I'm going to imagine you'll take me to the fort. Yep. Ah, oh, that's cool. So what new things can I do with this new brand? I can think of one. Nothing here. <laughs> that's, that's just cool. Up. Oh. <laughs> I thought maybe you could. Can you chain them? You can chain them. Aha! That's how I get up top as well. Let me level up. Um, this is probably going to be a really long episode, so I'm going to leave it here before I get it carried on anymore. It's just so hard to stop playing. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one, guys. Bus fight, bus fight, bus fight, bus fight.